Alright, today is going to be a, a different video. Um, my grandpa and my sister will be showing how to make my grandmother's dump cake. Great grandmothers. Yeah, the bakers are washing their hands right now. Show me the ingredients. Yeah. How easy it is to make. Go over it, bud. Um, you'll need two cans of your favorite, uh... Pie filling. Pie filling. Uh, and then a white or brown yellow. cake... Yellow. Cake mix. Um, and two... Spoons of butter. Two sticks of butter. Two sticks of butter. Okay, butts. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, get okay. Preheat the oven. We're going to set the oven at... Uh, 350. Go ahead and open the butter bucks. Yeah. Drop it in there. We're going to put that in the microwave and have that pre-melted. Sometimes a good chef always uh, adds some cigarette ashes to the recipe. So, but uh, Bugs here. isn't going to allow me to do this, so I'm just going to have her take care of most of this. How long will it be in there? Just till it's melted. Okay. So we'll put it in for what? Put it in for probably about two minutes. For starters, all right. Go ahead and uh, open the cans and uh, dump. Like the cake's called the dump cake. All the ingredients just get dumped in a pan. It's real simple. After we add the ingredients, of course, you have the pie filling first, but you can oh. open it. I know my hands are slippery because of the butter. Okay. Oh. Yeah, she's gone. Okay, Here, you've got all this stuff out of there. Let me see. Yeah. See if I can make a mess. <laughs> Close enough. Anybody want to lick the can? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And then what you do? It's like Should jello. You put it in the pan, huh? It's like jello. I know. It's not leveling out. It will in a minute. Yeah. Let me see something. I can get some here, bugger booze. What should I use? Uh, Anything. Oh, one of these. It don't matter, huh? No. I can rinse that off. That works. Just kind of... Flatten that out. Flatten it out in the pan here. Now, if we was going to use an uh, apple pie filling, you, you know, instead of the uh, blueberry, you could even sprinkle some cinnamon in on top of this. And if it was a cherry... One, some people like to put a uh, sliced canned pineapple in it. You can also, if you don't want to use pie filling, you can use uh, uh, canned fruit. I've done, we've done some with uh, fruit cocktail. I didn't care for those. Yeah. We've used crushed pineapple before to make it kind of like a pineapple upside down cake. This is kind of like what it's going to be like anyway. It's like more like an upside down cake. Go ahead and add the, pot, the cake mix, buds. Okay. Yep, just pour it on the top. Uh, it won't, you notice you don't mix anything in it, no eggs or nothing like that stuff like you would make in a cake. Because all this is going to be intended to do is just make like a crust. Spread it around real even, buds, evenly across the top. Get a fork, put it around a little bit, bugs, and just let okay. it level with the pan. Here, I'll get it a little closer. Here, you go ahead and just kind of sprinkle it around a little bit. Don't, you don't have to pack or nothing. You need a little more at this end, right up in there, it's on the edge. You just take the butter. Oops. It don't matter if it tears up the stuff a little bit. It's all going to go around anyway. And then, it's okay if the dump cake looks like a dump yeah, cake. Yeah, it's a dump cake. <laughs> that's the beauty of it. You just dump the stuff in it. Uh, we probably could have used a stick and a half of butter, but two's going to work just fine. Yep. Okay. Now, we just put it in the oven, huh? Yep. Okay, we're going to... You set the on the top one, right? Yep. Okay. A second. You want this. to put it in? No, I'll let you put it in. I'm just going to slide the thing out and make it easier for you. Just set it on the top there. 
and come back. I'm going to cook this for about so steak and gloves. Okay. Anyway, that's going to be in there for probably about an hour or until the crust is golden brown. So, guess we'll get back with you when it's done. So after all that, the dump cake should be done. And put a nice cloth down so that way you don't accidentally burn your counter. It's best served hot, so go get, go get the topping. Find the topping for it. And then after all of that, you get your ice cream, any flavored ice cream, Preferably vanilla. Preferably vanilla, yeah. And then you your preference is. Over in some plates and enjoy. Dump cake all the mode. And then, dump cake all the mode. I think it's a bit too, really still too frozen a little bit. Sure. It's too frozen, sweetie. Yeah. yeah. I'm getting it all over myself. <laughs> you just got to dig down in it, kind of twist it. Get a ball of it out of there. I don't want a big piece. I'll take the small one. And plus the leftover stuff that went with it. I don't yeah. care if mine looks like a mess. Marky can lick the pan. Yeah. <laughs> that looks like some Pinterest stuff. JR? Right that you was perfect. Up? How many of us are there? Uh, um, like seven. Two, four, six, seven. Yep. Mm. I'm still not doing it. Me, Ma. Some, too. Okay. It's yeah. Ooh. I'll just add that to that one. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> there we go. Wow. It kind of looks like chocolate. <laughs> kind of. A little bit, yeah. Only plates in here. Uh, I'll help you with ice cream, sweetie, because that's too hard. Yeah, yeah. just one more plate. What? Just one more plate. Just one more? Yeah. That's all of us? Yep. I believe so. Since we're not going to get it all eaten tonight, what goes in the fridge can be reheated in the microwave and uh so they have the ice cream on yeah i'm probably going to try it frozen later yeah that's a good scoop down in there a little bit good nice. enough put the lid on that put the ice cream away and we're done yeah so this is dump cake yeah. easy to make hope you enjoy it.